Welcome back guys. Today is a good day. I've just had my basketball hoop delivered. It's one of these big freestanding jobbies. I uh, used to play basketball a long time ago back in college and you get old and you forget. So it was about time I bought another one and got back into it. Uh, it's a b-ball optimum full-size NBA malarkey. So it's the proper one. It's adjustable height 2.3 up to 305. I don't think I can dunk anymore. Uh, one criticism I've seen online is that the instructions are a bit of a nightmare putting this together so I guess we'll see but I thought it'd be fun just to film the process like I did with the playhouse see if I can put it together myself and um, yeah just have some fun with it so uh, let's get started just seen the size of it. She's not happy. Step three is really confusing. You need to turn this the correct way around again. And this is the orientation you need. W in. Highest hole at the back, furthest away. Next one goes in there. show it but they don't show you which bolt you need E I think it's E that's the one you need it's only one that isn't in the rest of the instructions has to be D Right, we're all done. So it took me about four hours to build and about five cups of tea, but I did it on my own. And yeah, it was difficult. The, the instructions, my God, they need improving. They're like some bolts, they're all there, but you didn't know which bolts went where. And yeah, all right, if, if you take your time, you really go through the instructions slowly, you can figure it out, but they could definitely be improved. Just whoever wrote them could have done a better job, to be honest. Uh, but the end result, I'm really impressed with it. It's very sturdy, uh, very chunky, like the, the metal 
they've used is just proper chunky the only thing i'm a little bit concerned about is that the backboard is at a slight angle i've tightened up some of the bolts again and um it's still not quite level so i need to look at that a little bit closer to find out what's going on there it's almost as though the um the metal girders aren't quite aligned properly but we'll see in general yeah i definitely recommend it as you've already seen it's very sturdy the backboard is good it's got a lot of uh, metal kind of support behind it um so th there isn't much flex or bounce on it and um yeah it wasn't cheap but you get what you pay for i guess so um yeah thumbs up highly recommend it i hope this video has helped if it has please consider subscribing give the video a thumbs up drop a comment and i'll see you soon